So pretty much that's it. That's all we really have to do here. But there is one last event. One last thing that we want to do. We have to wait for Crimea to get up. Actually, I think I can fast forward time, right? I'll wait for it to switch the time and then... Yeah. I'm sorry, but I do not really care for this whole screen shrinky thingy. Sure, it's cool, but it's a little annoying. It looks weird on my TV. Okay, where is she? I know she's here somewhere. Okay, first we have to find Crimea. Maybe she's in the barn. So I, I don't really remember this part all that well. Here she is. I guess right. Oh my, hello. Romani's gonna take our milk to Clock Town too. You're looking after the place. The cows, the cows will be all alone otherwise. Yes, sister. I'm going by wagon into town. Would you like a ride? I'll be leaving about six o'clock this evening. So if you, can, so you can join me if you'd like. So there we go. Now we agree to go with her to Clock Town. And what do we do? We play do 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 do. Proceed to the night of the second day. I find it funny how her sister is just the older Ma Malin sprite. Not sprite, but model. Whatever you want to call it. And here is the wagon! Let's go and talk to her before she rides off without us. Oh, good evening. I'm going to town now to deliver milk. Would you like a ride? Yes, I would, in fact. That's great. Tonight I'm kind of lonely. I welcome company. We have a little theme song going here. I guess it's been a while now since our father died. I'm trying to take care of the ranch, but things have been getting something something lately. The cows always seem bothered and frazzled, and I'm finding broken bottles everywhere. Who's doing it? I don't know. My sister Romani has been worried too. She's been practicing using a bow. She says it, she's using it to stop the ghosts. Say, what are the townsfolk saying about that moon? It's bigger than before, isn't it? Man, she talks too fast. I can't keep up. In town, I have a friend. Her name's Anju. Oh, I know her. Anju, the day after tomorrow is her wedding. Okay. I wonder if it will fall. That thing. Yeah, I'm sure it's really perfectly normal for a moon to have a gigantic face like that. So as we ride down here, we see a fence that was constructed overnight. Or over day, whatever you want to say. What? The road. Boy, get your bow ready. Yeah, she wants me, a little kid, to shoot bandits in the face. She is such a good influence, I swear. First Milk Road is blocked by a boulder, and now we have to take this detour through ugly country. Hard to tell, she doesn't like them. Are you ready, boy? I'm going to try and get us through here as fast as I can. If any pursuers come from from behind, chase them off with your arrows. They may be off after my cargo of milk bottles. Do you understand? Weren't you paying any attention? Okay. Yes, I understand. Thanks, I'm relying on you. And of course they show up right after she stops. So basically we can spam our arrows here. 
tell who those guys are by their Whoa! I still can't believe that Kame expects a little kid to shoot bandits in the face. It's like, yeah, you're eight years old, but I don't care. You can go and kill those guys anyway. All for my milk. That could have been interpreted very badly, but oh well. I don't care. Anyway, a very simple mini game. Just shoot the bandits. There's a mask that you can get to cheat on this, actually. You wear it and they won't approach at all. We can't get it yet, though, so it doesn't matter anyway. Mr. Barton was happy to get his first delivery in quite a while. Thank you. You're pretty cool. This isn't very big, but accept my thanks. We get Romani's Mask, where it was C to show you're a member of the exclusive milk bar. By doing one good deed, a child becomes an adult. That mask is only given to a limited number of adult customers. It's proof of membership. I now acknowledge you as being an adult. Pedophile. No, not really. I'm just saying. Now, if we already get the mask, I think she gives you a hug instead. Like, that's supposed to be a lot better than the mask itself. I don't know. Anyway, we are pretty much done. With, uh, Lon Lon Ranch, anyway. Temptation! Rupees, awesome. Okay. Anyway, now that we're done here... I am going to cut this video, and I will see you guys in the next episode. I'm probably going to play the Song of Time, farm some rupees, farm some things, and whatnot, to get ready for the next part, because in the next episode, we will be going to the Great Bay. See you guys then.